my goodness, it's bright. <laughs> okay. Hey everyone, and in today's video, I'm going to be making a homemade squishy. Now, I know I haven't made a homemade squishy in a while, but I'm just... That's Buddy, by the way. I'm just super excited because I haven't made one in so long. Uh, well, ah. The last one I made was my bubble tea one, and now that I'm looking back at it, it doesn't look that good. Like, it's not rounded enough. It just looks like a rectangle. It's not, it doesn't look like a cup, and I don't know. I feel like I could do better now. So, today I'm going to be making a cotton candy squishy, and for some reason, my sponges are super dusty, but... You don't have to use sponges, you can use memory foam, but the only memory foam I can find uh, is memory foam pillows, and those things are like $30, and I don't have $30 right now. I have $30, because I spent so much money on, on stuff, mostly just squishies, because you know I love squishies, so yeah, I'm just going to have to use the dollar store sponges so i actually got these a while ago but then i lost the sponges so i couldn't make a homemade squishy so yeah and then i found all four of them so i'm super excited the hot glue gun is getting hot so maybe it should stop okay so first i'm gonna have to take off this green stuff from the top of the sponge so if you're using the same dish sponges that I'm using. Oh my goodness. Ugh, okay. Then uh, you'll just have to take off these things and then you'll get like this part which you're going to want to take off too. So, oh my goodness. Uh, I'm going to just touch you guys down a bit. Hopefully the tripod doesn't fall. Okay, I'm back. So, I have a sponge, and you're just going to want to take it off. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so... Sorry, I can't do this. Okay. No, I ripped off a bunch of the foam. See, it's really hard to rip this stuff off. But I'm just going to do this for now. I'm just going to... Yeah, it's a lot of foam that I just ripped off. Okay. So, I'm just going to keep ripping and ripping. Look at all that foam I just ripped off. Whoopsie. It's really hard to do this right now. But it's okay. It doesn't actually really matter because I'm going to be making a cotton candy today. So uh, I'm already going to be cutting off the edges. So I'm not actually that mad. But yeah, this will be nice. This extra piece of foam for some other time so if I need like an accessory for a squishy then I can just use this so I'm just gonna uh, take this piece of foam off okay voila okay guys I'm back oh my goodness it's so bright I don't know why it's so bright. Okay, so now that I've got my two sponges, I'm just going to hot glue them together. And yeah, and then I'll just have to wait for that to dry. So I'm going to pick up the hot glue gun and I'll just put a little dollop of hot glue onto there. My goodness, why isn't it just going out? Okay, there we go. So, I'm just going to put a little dollop 
the hot glue and I'm going to spread that around. Now if you're using hot glue you want to be careful because obviously it's hot so you don't want to burn yourself. I have gotten hot glue on my fingers many times so I'm kind of used to it but yeah it doesn't feel very nice so I'm just going to put that on now. Hopefully it hasn't dried probably. I just took off that bit of hot glue because I need to. Okay. So. Okay. I'm just going to finish hot gluing. Oh my goodness, I cannot do this. This is seriously so hard to like hold up one end and then like put on hot glue on the other but I'm just gonna close that up now Ugh. okay so I'm just going to get this So, yes, should be dry soon. So, yeah. Okay, guys, so I just got to glue this corner, and it should be good to go. And then I will plug in the phone. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, why doesn't the tripod want to stand up? And... Just gonna hot glue this bit together. Forget every little bit. Spread that around. And hot glue. Okay. So now I'm going to plug your guys in to the charger. Okay, I'm just being stupid and do right now. So I'm just gonna carefully pick this up and put it somewhere to dry where the kitties can't knock it down. And I'm going to charge you guys. Okay, guys. Here's the piece of foam. And just got to get some scissors so I can round it out. It will be good to go. I don't know why I keep doing this. But I should really stop. Okay, guys. So I got the scissors. And I'm just going to trim it. So, wait. Something. Okay, I'm back. Whoa. What's going on? Okay. I'm just going to trim the edges. So, for this cotton candy squishy, you're just going to want to trim the edges of your foam and then just going to uh, yeah just trim the edges of your foam and it should be pretty good you want to make it a nice round shape oh sorry So, just keep snipping piece after piece after piece so you can get the roundest shape you can get. So, this is a little time consuming when you are making your squishy, but, you know. Okay. Okay, I'll see you when it's all cut. <laughs> Okay guys, so I have my squishy right here. So since I added such a thin layer of hot glue, it's not 
there's no hard spots in the middle of my squishy. So you can add hot glue, but you can't add such a hard, like, you can't add such a thick layer or else you'll get a hard bot spot in your squishy. Here, this is the things go. Sorry, there's just some pieces sticking up. I didn't notice earlier. You guys don't understand, like, wait, I need to show you. Look at all these snips I made. Just for this, okay. I made some pretty big ones, too, because I was taking off, like, chunks because it was a little too tall. So, well. So I need to hot glue some of the places uh, uh, again because some of the places, I don't know. Okay. They just didn't really stick together very well. So I'm just going to do that now. Okay. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Okay. See, I'm kind of like spreading it around with the tip. So I'm just going to close it and wait for that to dry. Okay, guys, so I added some more hot glue. Blah, 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 blah. So, yeah. And, um, now that that's all done, we can just, I don't know. So, I'm going to, that was like super cringy. I'm just going to cut some bits out of the bottom. Because this is where I'm going to be putting the stick for the cotton candy. So I'm just going to rip out little bits of foam so I can fit that stick in there. Okay. Now, I'm just going to glue. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> well. Okay, guys. So I have the squishy here and I have the stick. So I'm just going to stick it in. So I'm going to stick it in like this. It to be in more. So when I squish it, I'm going to feel the stick a little bit down here. But that's okay because I can still hold it. So I'm just going to. Get some hot glue and put some hot glue in there. Hopefully that put hot glue in there. I really don't know. And stick it in. Now I'm just going to wait and see if I actually put hot glue in there. I don't know, but yes. Okay, guys, so now the stick is in. So, this is going to have to be a part one. You probably saw from the thumbnail. Because, yeah, I don't know. Or not thumbnail, the title. Might not be a part one. Might. Actually, I think I can make it. Okay, I'm just, I'm just like, I see. And basically, it can be part one. I mean, part two. I mean, no, no. Okay, why did I just do that? Okay, please excuse me. I'm just being super weird right now. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So, you're probably wondering, oh my gosh. The camera angle just changed. But, yeah. If I didn't change the camera angle, it would not be very fun. Because I wouldn't be able to paint the squishy without... It would be harder to paint squishy. So I have all my colors. Um, I have pink, purple, and blue. So I'm just going to make all of the colors. Okay, so. Yes. Okay, guys. So I'm just going to put some of the paint on here. Just bit after bit. Paint. 
So this is going to have to be a part one and part two because it will probably, or I don't know, it depends on how long it takes to dry. Okay, on camera it looks like a really weird blue, but in person it looks like a pretty cute blue. So I don't know why it's doing that. Okay. I'm just gonna get a little spot with paint. So uh, I'm going to do the ketchup Gary method, I guess. I don't know. I'm just gonna use the glove like ketchup Gary does and paint with that. Okay. So now I'm going to need Okay, so now it's time for the second or should it be? should it not? I'll just keep painting. Okay, that's kind of a lot, but that's okay. That's what we want. We want a lot of things. So we can paint it. Okay. There we go. So now I've got enough blue, and I'm just going to get on with the next color. Oh my goodness. These gloves make my hands so sweaty. They're so hot. Okay. So now, I'm going to bring this up, but I want to be careful because I kind of want to make them sort of blend together, although I've never made colors blend together, so I don't know how well I'm going to do at this, but I hope I do little good. So I'm just gonna get just gonna get some of this purple on the newspaper so I can paint it. Are you gonna come out bro? Okay, yeah it doesn't want to come. <laughs> come on. There we go. Okay, the color did not want to come out. So I'm just going to... Okay. Ugh. I'm definitely going to have to add more than one coat of this color, or of these colors, because as you can tell, the blue, you could already see through, like, the blue, and you can still see the yellow, and we don't want to see the yellow, but we don't, but we also don't want a thick layer of paint, so I'm probably going to add two and see what happens, and hopefully I won't have to add a thick layer of paint, because I really don't want to do that. Okay, so now I'm going to try to get them to blend. Uh, okay, this is going to be like really hard. So, can I get like this thing going away? Okay, I'm going to like sort of mix the colors. Make sort of a purple and blue. Okay, so I'm going to get my mixing stick, mix that up. Working, sort of not. Uh, I can my finger 
just go into the glove. Okay, so. Okay, it's sort of blending. Yeah, it blended. Yay, I did it. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just going to keep doing that to make them sort of blend well. -y. Okay, that looks nice. So I'm just going to, probably just going to add a little more purple. Just because. Why not? 